What an evening with the fire, seeing the sun going down slowly, listen to all the birds. Today, or <clears throat> it is evening, I am at Lake Öjaren and I'm going to sleep up in a windshield to test my new sleeping bag. What a beautiful evening. Really beautiful. I have some side waves here, but it's no problem. My experience of sleeping outdoor is it's very limited. Yes, <laughs> yesterday, last year, I was camping one night in tent with my whole family, and I also slept in this windshield that I'm going out to now. Before that, it was 1999 when I slept outside. So, very limited experience. Well, we can say that it's outside my comfort zone. But now we're going to change this. I know that it was going to be windy today and I had a loaded board. So I choose to go with the Eisbach Riders Touring Fin. And uh, it performs really well. I have too much stuff with me, but I'm not sure what I'm going to use or not. So this is kind of testing so I have little more that I need with me this will be really good it's so beautiful and it's not so windy it's been really windy all day and I can see the waves going out on the lake but here between the islands it's so calm and I'm going to sleep in the windshield my sleeping bag my new sleeping bag is just on the comfort limit for uh, the temperature in night. Four plus degrees. We will see if I will freeze or not. I'm going to look after um, nails so I don't destroy anything of my new expensive uh, equipment. <laughs> I don't want to do that. There are only nails here in the beginning and from here up to like this. It's free of nails and inside there you have nails again. So I have an area here. What an evening with the fire, seeing the sun going down slowly, listen to all the birds. I'm on my way to check if we see the sunset, but it seems like it's a little cloudy and it's also starting to blow a little more. Ah, the sun are behind a lot of clouds, not much of a sunset. It took some time to set up my camp for the night, but now I'm happy. This is ah, a sleeping mat, an inflated sleeping mat, and here it's my new sleeping bag, Rab. Three not 200 and it's uh, under 600 degrees so it's really light and comfort temp for this should be 4 degrees and it's going to be 3 or 4 degrees in the night so we will see if it's worth the money. <clears throat> Good morning. I had 
like a goose or swans that woke me up. They was giving a lot of noise for a very long time, but now it's quiet, but I will go and see if I find any of them. Only sun behind the clouds. Compared to what I had last year when I slept in this windshield, my new sleeping bag was really warm. It kept me warm until like 6 in the morning uh, and I had a lot of extra clothes with me but not in the sleeping bag. Next time I will have them in the sleeping bag because I was too tired to, to um, get them from the other bags. Time to paddle home. I'm going to have headwind when I'm going home and I already see the wind picking up so I'm going to get started because it's going to be really windy today. Help me board. Huh. It takes a lot of energy from me to do something that I'm not used to do, like sleeping outside in a windshield, but I want to do more of this. Time for the Swedish lesson. We have a fire and it's really cozy. Fire, eld. Cozy, mysigt. Jag sitter vid elden och har det mysigt. I sit <laughs> we have a smoke. Mm. Det var riktigt mysigt framför elden ända till röken kom i mina ögon. Hope you like that Swedish lesson. Follow for more. I think if you follow this you can soon talk Swedish. <laughs> Click here to subscribe and watch more videos. Thank you for watching and See you until then. Padda lugnt!